Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome to day three of Xenoblade Chronicles. Future Connected, Amelia and her gangster pawns. Last yesterday, we got a lot of stuff unlocked. Now we got a lot of quests to clear up, so let's get it done. What's the Okay. And you. Okay, so I think it's everything in sync. That's weird. I felt like it wasn't in sync anyway. X. Green. Okay, um. On map. What we got? Got a lot of reds and a lot of reds everywhere. So let's go. I don't know what it is, but we'll see. What's up there? An item. Okay, that's weird. How'd it get there? Okay, how the hell did he get up there? I'm definitely missing a way to get up there. I mean, logically, you would think it's this way, unless I was blind and, um... Or maybe you gotta go all the way up and then jump down. Approach my limit. Not to worry. Kino good at improvising. Ah. Aha. Uh. Oh, we got our her thing. Holy crap. Got all of it. What's, what's here? Oops. One button.
Press start him? Oh, yes. Oh, I, I think I know what it is. Seriously, that reminds us like that giant eyeball in um, Lord of the Rings. Look at the eye. Come on, give me poison, poison. Here, I think we start from. Uh. We measure uh. or treasure uh. against the pond till we die. Oh, good, it's here. Ah. Oh, so you can see this now. Sweet wasabi 
that Nene picked. Please to eat and be hearty. This this most delicious experience of eating life. Brave Kino, this unworthy psychic traveled all across Bionis. <clears throat> Even had to play tag with Robert one time. Sister upon that amazing! Nene overcome many a scuffle scratch to obtain this sweet wasabi. Please to save a mouthfeel. Kino will. Kino eats every last bit, including steps. That was somewhat adorable. <laughs> oh, we can actually explore this part now, I bet. Miss Tyrea seem like difficult sort of person to deal with. Difficult, huh? Maybe so, but she's still far more mellow than before. Miss Melia and Miss Tyrea know each other from where? Well, it's... It's a little complicated to explain. Complicated? How? Hmm. I'm just not quite sure where to begin. For one... Tyrea and I had never met until one year ago. Houses too far apart, or...? I was not allowed to venture outside. Moreover, I never even knew of her existence. She, on the other hand, seemed to know about me. We... We never met because work had been busy. But how Miss Melia never know of? If sisters, then of course she'd know. That's true. How can I explain this? Tyrea and I have separate parents. Different fathers and different mothers, both. Mime! In the same boat as Nene and Kino, then! Just like you and Kino, Tyrea and I are not related by blood. But we had a half-brother with whom we shared a parent each. Half-brother? Hmm. No parents in common but a brother we are both related to. Therefore, Tyrea and I are not exactly complete strangers. Me, me, me! Brain of Nene starting to melt! I'm sorry. I did say it's complicated. Nene does not understand. If both have same brother, why cannot be one family together? Our parents being different, I and Tyrea have led very different lives. We never even met let alone behaved as a family. 
neither knows how to relate to the other, and so we struggle on. It sounds like Miss Melia and Miss Tyrea both feeling more like Kino. How do you mean? Kino also not talk to anyone at first. Very Heidi shy shy. I don't think I'd call myself or Tyrea shy, exactly. If you want to become good friends, but not know how to put in action, then it's exactly the same. Hmm. But, as can see for self, now Nene and Kino super best of friends. Do tell, how did you two achieve that? Would you teach me the way, please? Answer is clear as day. Nene prescribed lots of play play. Play play? Also, sharing of yummy snacks and sleep together in the same bed. If do that, become family in wink of eye. I'm not sure I can do that with Tyrea. Seems like a lot. Meh! Nene patience is exhaust! Miss Melia want to be sisters with Miss Tyrea or not? Uh, yes. I would really like that, I think. So, now is best and only chance. No time for hemmings and whorings. Best and only? Hmm? Perhaps you're right. Okay, then now Miss Melia go and say, Hey, Sister Bon, come play! <gasps> right now? I need some time to compose myself. Oh, if Miss Melia must, but have to promise to ask soon. Yes, I will. One day very soon. Jesus. Ready for a quest tracker. <laughs> oh, sweet. I'm definitely gonna give that a mil yeah. Oh, perfect. I was gonna go here anyway. We let's see if we can do this uh, cutscene. Perfect. Oh, such very depressed. What is it, Kino? Has something happened? Ah, uh, Miss Melly. Why the sighing? It's unlike the bright, bubbly Kino I know. What? Kino not allowed to be moody? It's sensitive, especially at age of now. I see. And I hope you'll forgive me. So something worrying you? Anything you care to discuss with me? Doubt if can help. But maybe Miss Mally have some advice. Oh, very well. 
In that case, I'm all ears. Keynote follow Miss Belly and Shaw calls Skulky Light to come with. Hmm. Yes, quite. But at start, Kino never think Kino come to such very far away place. That boy, when Kino leave, Kino not say bye bye to Mama Pan. If Kino come back now, there's sure to be heck to pay. And Mama Pan angry, wants to look like Chew Toy. Just thought of remember makes move Goku plunge. Hmm. Did Oka really have such force of character? But don't fret. It's only because she worries about you. That intensity is nothing but a sign that you are loved dearly, Kino. Miss Molly sure? Yes. I'd say she only scolds you because she cares. Mama Pan get angry because love? Kino not really understand. Look at it this way. Kino, you are her beloved son. If you were hurt, Oka would be sad, would she not? Therefore, when she scolds you, it's to try and ensure that you don't put yourself in harm's way. So, do not think it cruelty. Oh, <gasps> Kino, no! Everything resolved. If you miss Melly, just ask Mama Pond to tone down harsh when angry at Kino. If you do that, even Mama Pond may become a bit gentle in upon. No, that I cannot do. Mama, why no? You really need me to explain. Isn't it the mark of a hero pawn to take responsibility for their own actions? At least I believe Ricky did. To an extent. If you wanted to come with us, you should have asked Ricky and Oka's permission to begin with. Don't you think that's what a hero pawn ought to do? Mama! You'll find as you go through life, similar situations may reoccur. If they do, and if you act the way you did this time, nobody will acknowledge you as a true hero upon. Miss Molly so strong. You know, admit defeat. Sneaking onto boat was naughty behavior. <laughs> Kino, once you realize you have done wrong, you must reflect on it and rectify it as soon as you can. If you let the chance slip you by, you may not get another. Kino got it, Miss Melly. From now, Kino promised to never follow friends or sneaky skulky again. We'll follow friends proudly. Oh. <laughs> it seems I didn't explain properly after all. What you did wrong was to cause Oka undue concern. So you'll have to accept your punishment, put time into self-reflection, and next time, simply do better. That is the behavior that will let you grow on your path as a mighty hero. Understood. Kino promise. Hmm. I wonder if he really understood.
lower my healings maxed out. Oh, it's not. That's why. It felt a little low for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, we want anchor chain. So we're holding off. Oh, the dead end? Oh, electric. Actually, what is the gems I'm using right now? Ether up three. Do I need that many H? Oh, I got new debuff reason. HP up, it's kind of crazy. <laughs> this one. Dropped down another rank. I think there's an NM up there, seriously. I really do think there's an NM up there. I'm gonna go a little more de defensive. Yeah, there's an NM up there. Oh, there it is. Oh god, not one of those crazy bastards. I have a feeling he's gonna aggro everything, so but we'll try anyway. Your attack. Nene, 
You've been doing so well, Nene. Hey, that's not fair. Miss Rally can only draw three too. Prepare yourselves. They meet their match with Kino. They're the guy with everything. A little messy, but it works. Hopefully it's a good uh, upgrade. Meteor star- ah, oh, that would have been nice. Too bad it's one slaughter. What am I using? Yeah, meter staff is- What's my timing? Oh no, chest? Really? That sucks. It looks like I cleared the whole mess. Oh, this is the only part I've not finished exploring. But everywhere else I explored completely. But this part, it. Well, not from that. Let's definitely check the uh, cave. Only in them have not fought there either. <laughs> Double tap. Yeah, pretty good. Electric plus. Yes! Actually, I don't even use that much. <laughs> Damn it. At least I have a double attack now and haste.
Ah, one slaughter. Damn. The best. That's kind of sad, year wise. Then again, this is like just an expansion, you know, like a uh, one chapter. Uh, you don't really, can't really expect much. So. How are you liking Future Connected? I'm loving it, actually. The um, quiet moments are amazing. I love the voicing, the natural, you know, the, you know, the talking to each other is, it's great. It's great. They really, they really dwell into the um, development of these four characters. The gangster puns are adorable. Oh, I do agree, man. The gangster puns are amazing. <laughs> Yeah, but these quiet moments are great. I love watching this. Compared to the original one, the heart to heart. Oh, Kyrie. Oh, that would've been cool, actually. That would be cool. I hope... Actually, there was one, um, Family Relation. This one was actually cool. They talk about her sister. I'm hoping at least near the end of this um, game, you know, Future Connected, they'll actually make up or something i'm really really hoping for it I, re I really am actually i was surprised i saw her sister i did not expect that at all honestly i was it was great though i was like holy shit she's still alive and all that you know that was great it was really great well, actually you know before I go here i'm gonna buy some books I wish the game developer make a DLC with a sister. Oh, see her point of view? That would be interesting. She, she'll probably fight like Fiora. Because she's a uh, assassin thief. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that would have been great if she was part of this future connected too. She could be the uh, Fiora character in this one. That's what we have a mage, we have a tank, we have a healer, we have Shulk. And we're just missing a Fiora like character. That would have been perfect. Wait a minute, I didn't, uh... Oh... Um, let's see what we need. Nothing here, really. Um, what's this? I don't even know what the... I don't even know. I need to look at his skills, because I have no idea. Hammer beat. Uh, let's see what else. Uh, anchor chain I got. Oh, gee. I gotta look at art. Okay, this. Okay. Um. There, yeah, will be good. Angry will be good. Oh, fine, let me go. Oh, aura. Yeah, this one. Aura toast will be very helpful. Okay, let's get aura toast. Then for him. Uh, what's this? Buff me. Hmm. I got the three healing already. That's the main thing. This healing kind of would help indicate. Oh, I'm actually enjoying Future Connected. That was, it's really, it kind of sucks. You're not, you don't have your OP, you know, build and gears and everything from the original, but still. A actually, this in Future Connected, you don't really have to worry about gear and stuff too much or gems. Even though it would be helpful as hell, because that makes. You know, that's why Megmillia is so strong because of the gems. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. I'm really enjoying it. What do you think I should get? Shield or really counter?
Do you think the FC gameplay will make good will make for a good sequel? Um Honestly no. I mean it's good enough for this. The, uh, you know this uh a extra chapter. I think it's good enough, honestly. I don't see how you can expand much of it other than having hundreds of gangster pawns. It would be like almost like Art Tonentical 2 with the uh, Raven Tales. I don't know if you play that, but that's a good um me. Because the more Raven Tales you have, you can have up to 100 Raven Tales, the more damaging your um, a replica will do. Still trying to see where they go with FC. Uh, well, I'll see what I see. Okay, shield cooldown will be. But. I think Healy Counter would be much better. Yeah, let's get Healy Counter. And what's the other one? Healy Counter and. Or Oh! Um, I'm trying to finish summon ice right now. Actually, getting Gillian Glyph might, gift might be a good idea. Yeah, let's do that. Help out. Um, or toast. Oh, finish the anchor chain first. Actually, I think anchor chain is fine. Work at or toast a little bit. Then... Oh, almost have enough. We'll go down to 33 seconds. Yeah, oops. This is fine. You're just cool, man, seeing your little gangster pawn like that. <laughs> Does an aggro? Hickman? <laughs> actually, it does. It actually does. Oh, NM. Oh shit, NM. That's a lot of enemies though. I don't know those two things. I might aggro a lot of enemies, but it's fine. Oh yeah, I do. Chaos! Damn, yeah, Nini's doing a good job of holding Agri. Oh, Easy. Good job, Nini. Oh, that's just fun watching those little gangster pawns. <laughs> Whacking the enemies to death. Oh, come on, give me three slaughter, please. One, three slaughter. Oh, shit. Actually, this is weaker than with the meteor stuff, but this might be helpful. This might be. Uh, this should be an upgrade. This should be an upgrade. 
Oh, hell yes, it's an up. Wait! Oh, here, yeah. It's still an upgrade. It is still an upgrade. Um, what do I have? Ether up, HP up. Um, should I use Art Heal? Chill plus is not enough. I don't have poison plus eat. I mean, it still gives me HP back, so I can actually spam more. Does actually... using it count? Wait, Pokemon's- I don't- I have never played Pokemon Sword and Shield, so I can't say anything about that. I'm gonna try this. This could help me out. Location. We can climb? Wait! Oh, so there's more to it! We can't get any further, so storyline locked. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. I'm... So pretty much I've done everything there is possible. Almost. Oh, I find get the final gangster. Hello, Ogo Pogo, welcome back. I finally got the last gangster pawn. Strength of four, that'll be helpful. I believe so. Oh, I was clearing out the quest. So I I did everything. I did every possible thing. So I'm just coming back here to turn it in. Well, except for the one you gotta talk to people. I have to do that one. But I already got like you know gather all the items needed and stuff. Golden Shroom. What the heck? Oh really? Is it's a fight? Oh boy. Okay, we'll see. It's okay, we have a gangster pawn. I still need revenge on that lizard. And in fact, I crashed while fighting the damn enemy. Then and them. That sucked. Oh, 
Wait, I was just there! I don't know, Golden Shroom just sounds a little too naughty. Oh, that's a lot of EXP too, Christ. Level 78? Yes, I got the last one! Got the full gangsta. What level am I? 75? Okay, yeah. It might be a little tough. Let's see what he's, how he says it. What's this sh shout? We measure! Find treasure! Pun specters till we die! Eh. It's okay. We measure! Find treasure! Pun specters till we die! Meh. We measure! Find treasure! Pun specters till we die! Mm, that's okay. We measure! Find treasure, pun specters, till we die. That's not too bad. We measure, find treasure, pun specters, till we die. That was good. We measure, find treasure, pun specters, till we die. That was not bad. We measure, find treasure, pun specters, till we die. Okay, that has some feelings to it. We measure, find treasure. Pun till we die! Uh, feels the same. That's the set set. We measure! Find treasure! Pun specters till we die! That's okay. We measure! Find treasure! Pun specters till we die! Hmm, it's okay. We measure! Find treasure! Pun specters till we die! Wow, that was good. We measure! Find treasure! Pun specters till we That's die! The, this is the best. Okay. Last time we'll hear that, sadly. That was the best, by the way. Okay, at least I can get some new... Um... I think it's still talking to people. Me. I think? Me. <laughs> oh. Word. I still can't get the last two animals. Alright. Oh yeah, that's right, the Ether Pick up three.
Ah, oh, damn it. I should have gathered those before. But... What the hell is the shiny or key item? A oh, monster or key shiny. Shiny, I guess. No, it's NPC. Yeah. Oh, I see. <laughs> so it's Sentai. So it's pretty much like Sentai Rangers. That's a lot of them too, man. They're pretty much a Q, uh, Q Rangers then, in that case. About to get wild. Shock whore. <laughs> Acrophobia.
Man, character development. Mad respect for Ricky, seriously. <laughs> Mad respect. That's funny. Oh, how future connected some supposed to be Amelia's chance to shine? Oh, I mean, it still is, but holy god, the uh, the gangster pawn's actually really, really. Um, oh, okay, he paralyzed. <laughs> and the funny thing is, Ricky's not even in the uh, game. <laughs> he doesn't have any screen time. How the heck is this happening? It's like you're learning st stuff that you never knew about Ricky. <laughs> oh god, that's just funny, man. It's just funny. No screen time, but yet he's still getting screen time. But it's like Yu Gi Oh! A bridge right here. <laughs> Wait, how do I get there? How do I go? Please, chill plus six. Fight Diva. Fight Diva. I'll be up. Is it right here or else? Oh, it's right here. What's this? Yellow? Hmm. Poison? Maybe? Wait. Let's check it out. Entrance wing. Days for Uh. What other quests I got? In Grandel, I don't know who the hell's. Cool. Is 
This is great though. Oh, it's not sure. Yo, it's probably not time yet. Who's bad? Good time. Oh, sh even more quests. Yeah, I think I have that. Or do I? I guess not. You know what? get there actually where the hell is this bad is it here I'll keep actually let's see if I can get yes. new armor first uh no wait oh this is the wrong one wrong shop First, we don't care about show. Twenty k. So I only can buy about five items. I already have this. I'd rather prioritize the tanks and the healer right now. Oh sh! Oh wait, wait, okay, never mind. Get the crap out of me. Is that a guy who has a crush on... Is it? Maybe, I don't know. Wait. You mean the kid? The little kid? This is 14 and this is 22. We'll definitely get this one. I won't lie, I forgot. I don't re even remember half of the cast. <laughs>
Oh wow. Okay, so I need boots. Listen. Hello. I'm selling everything, I need the money. <laughs> but is there a reason to even have these? Oh shit. I didn't mean to, I didn't want to sell the whole thing, but Um, I think million needs here. That's not a oh, they share, huh? Oh, okay, so they share it fourteen thirty eight. Air to see. I need was gloves, right? Yeah, gloves and pants. I need for me. Yeah, that's a huge damn upgrade right there. Um. Guess we'll go eat. I can't get any pants though. I have no money left. Hello. They can sell items. Hello. Uh, we'll sell more of the. So we'll keep ten of. What the fuck did I do? Oh wait, wait. Oh, it's a sort number. That's why. Derp. Yeah, okay. So. That's enough to buy boots. No pants. Really I need pants. Ah oh, crap. I need 10k more. Ah, oh, that's fine. We can wait. I'm still upgraded more than normal, so. Check this. These spider. Didn't I kill this turtle already? Oh, I did. But we can kill it again. Just. Manifest yourself. Manifest yourself. Manifest yourself. 
Jesus. I thought the timing for this is a lot more stricter. I mean, it's unlike unlike uh, the first part of the game where you know, for the um, you know the hitting the B button, here is really needed if you want max uh, you want max potential from the gangster pawn. You spotted a Makinaga who actually fixed her I don't remember where she is either. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't remember where she is either. I'm at... I don't know why it's not showing up on here, that's the weird part. It should. I'm sorry. It's just that character or someone is not important enough for me to remember, unfortunately. Hello. It's way inside town on the first floor. I, I Okay, I'll uh, check it. Oh, just making friends. Thing. So here, town first. First. And buy Melia pants. That sounded wrong, but hello. Pants for Melia. Yes, pants. Pants. <laughs> Technically, it is in a way, I guess. Technically, I guess. I don't know. I will uh I should give her HP up for so get a little more HP. Hello. I need to buy the um, hero, uh, healing pawn. When he kills. Oh, that he doesn't have a slot. He's... Okay, you're saying here inside. Out on the first floor. Oh, some, some box. Oh, this guy. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, snap. Thank you. Uh, what? Hello. Maybe wrong character. Oh, that's maybe why. Maybe it's the wrong character. I don't remember who the hell asked. I will just try it. Oh, I'm supposed to check the eyeball. Oh, story lock maybe? Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm supposed to check the eyeball. Okay, that's fine. Okay, let's get that. Let's get some uh, mining first.
Fucking yellow. Where's the money? You know what? I'm gonna try that spider quest one. Just to see how hard it is. Pizza. Wait. Does that work on Kino? It should work on That would help actually. It wouldn't make sense for it to not work. Should I think it should? It'll be weird if it does. I forgot what else I got. Drink plus that'll be really good. I guess we'll give her strength. I think 50% is good enough to add some strength. Oh, near 50. I'm hoping I can get more. Oh, there's a quest over there, too. Oh, how did I get down there, though? We'll know eventually. Okay, that's something. Why is it all aggro? Uh. At least this suspend to win will help a lot. Drink down. I think I want to put on there. Okay, here's where I'm curious to see how to get. Or maybe not, it's just here. Okay, yeah, okay, never mind. I thought it was like a. Okay, I'm not gonna say anything, because I just feel really dumb right now. Oh, oh, that's why I never fought these enemies, so yeah, that makes sense. Nice. Double um silver chest. Okay, it has to be at least silver chest. This represents no problem. 
This is bullying, seriously. This is bullying. Wait, never mind, I was wrong. This is complete bullying. More money, I can buy shoes. Holy crap, I can buy shoes. There's a heart to heart here, too. Somewhere. Probably right there. Maybe. And I'm probably missing a landmark, I'm sure. Oh, maybe not. Perfect. And the timing is great too because of this uh, scenery. This area isn't very heavily cultivated. That might be why nature runs so rampant. Big step for Nupon! Kino make this into Frontier Village Mark II! Frontier Village, huh? I was amazed first time I saw it. All the pollen factories, built into that giant tree. Nupon never used metal if can be helped. Except for Sister Pon, who like use Hom Hom Shield very much. Oh, right. It's true, though. Ricky never did use a metal weapon. It looked more like a fruit of some kind. Kino here, this is actually gumberry that store ether within. Kino just make it suck in ether, and then it shoot out contents like real rifle. Is that right? I'm not sure I've ever seen a berry that big before. Indeedy. Kino never see one lying around before, that for sure. The plants that bear them must be very rare. I knew biters. But I didn't know you had curiosities like these. Well, Biter's still more popular. Little Pun Kino also wants to use Biter, but no beef on wings, so could not carry properly. But then, when Kino gets in big sulk, Dada Pun go and pick Gumberry from somewhere. Ricky did. So he can be a model father. I'm impressed. Yes, yes, Dada Pun is true hero Pun. This weapon only used now by Nopon 2 Wimpy to hold Biter, but Dadapon was first one to discover. Everyone jumped for happy when introduced. Ricky is a man of many talents, huh? A true hero pon indeed. Dadapon say, he get idea for making into weapon from Hom Hom gun. Inspired by a Hom's gun. Ah, Charla's ether rifle then. Though if he was going to make weapons, I would have been happy to help him out. How about if you shall give Kino pointers? Kino still not always hit target. Pointers, eh? From what I saw, though, it seemed like you knew your stuff. Kino also thinks so, but still sometimes miss. Right. Then maybe 
You'd best learn how to properly handle the weapon. Properly how? Hmm. Am I right to assume you've never really had proper training? Mama, how shock knowing of that? Kino, state of shock. I reckon the weapon's more beat up than it should be. You don't want that. More prone to malfunctions. What Kino should do? It's important to be as careful as possible. Handle it too roughly, and you could end up warping the grip. If the aim is a little off, it could potentially be because of that. Oh, Shock, no such things. Kino never figure out in a million years. I've always liked tinkering with weapons. Even made my friend Ryan's weapon, in fact. That'll be why. If you need a weapon maintained, I'm your guy. Shock really second most awesome after died upon. Tell Kino more, more, more! All right. But for now, let's reinforce this to help with your aim. In return, could you perhaps share some more stories? Kino liked that deal! Okay, again. <laughs> Ricky is getting screen time when he's not even in the game. Oh my gosh. Almost everything's about Ricky, seriously. <laughs> you learn so much stuff in this chapter alone than having Ricky in the whole original game. Aside from that, he's a hero pawn. But that's like the only thing you know from him. Here, you're learning so much stuff about him. Jesus. Back. That's amazing, man. Seriously. Amazing. Ah, come on, give me something good. HP steel. Um, she doesn't hit fast enough, so that's not gonna work. That's, she's not Fiora, that's for sure. Days plus would work on um. I'll check this core, see how much... <clears throat> Wait, what, 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 what are you r rolling on? Let me see. Oh my god, you maxed... 300? 300 dollars? I'm scared to answer, honestly. I'm really scared to answer. Post game of... Versus... Really, a Prana want to attack me. Good enough. I'm a... <clears throat> Honestly, there really is no post game for uh, the original because you can actually do everything before you beat the final boss. So actually, I fought the final. I fought, I killed all the super bosses before I did the final boss. So, so technically, <laughs> yeah, I like FC a lot though. I definitely like FC a lot. I know I can't do those two yet. Wait, there's one here. Oh. I know I can't do this. Shoot, I don't
Oh shoot! Wait, you can aggro? Oh, you can. Big D's can aggro. Oh, you know what? They're all gonna die. Let's do it! This represents uh, what's it up? Go oh, heal him. Really, I got them on this way. No way! No, I, I call BS on that. He did not spend that much. I call BS on that. Why that much? That's like a new computer. Wait, is this Canadian dollar? I mean, it's your money, so I can't really, you know, say much, but... Okay, so I don't know what the American dollar would be then. Destroyed by gangster pawns. Break for black. Um, give me something good. <laughs> Area cloak. Come on. Does anybody even use air cloak? You just really like that character, huh, Momi? Uh. I'm, I'm not to judge. I, who am I to judge? It's your money, you know. I'm just... <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I see. Wait a minute! We're the one who did the same with, uh... Um... Uh, Jay Alter? Or was it someone else? I know someone, someone maxed out Jay Alter. Oh, you, oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, he's under. Oh, just a quest or two. That was less. Oh, Ogopogo, I mean, like I said, I'm not the judge because, I mean, it is your monies. As long as you, you know, if, as long as you're responsible, hell, you can spend as much as you want, as long as you're responsible. That's the main key, being responsible. Don't be like that 
guy in Japan who sold his car and house for a Grand Blue Fantasy and didn't get what he wants. That's irresponsible right there. That was just messed up, man. Selling his house. Oh yeah, I know. I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, yeah, I understand. I understand. All of them. I'm just. I'm not saying that you're judging. I'm just saying. <laughs> It's just... Oh man. Just don't be like that guy who sold his house and car. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. Well, I'm just, you know, as a friendly... From a streamer to a viewer. I care for you all. I care for those who watch us. I care for my viewers. So. I mean, it's just a reminder, basically. Not a, you know. Yeah, of course I'm. Hey, I like you. I like all my viewers, man. I mean, I appreciate for you know, everyone that watches me or, you know, talk to me on Discord and chat and everything. I really appreciate that. No? I don't take it for granted, seriously. Uh -huh. I just don't want to see anybody I know end up in that situation. That would suck. That. Not this one, it's this one. Oh, is it from here you go under? Oh, it's oh wait, isn't that where that evil lizard is? I think it is. I, th I think it is. Oh, this is the evil lizard location. Come on. This is the evil lizard location. Uh, he must die. Enjoy. What level am I? I have a chance. I think I can fight him again. I do have better gear, much better armor, so that could make a huge difference. Could make a huge difference. I'm um, hoping I can get some HP up, a higher tier version. Come on. Well, I'll take that. Although I don't even know if this is actually working or not. I don't I don't even get hurt, so it's kind of hard to uh, gauge. I don't know what color this is. Okay, this one... I have no idea what to go for. Chill defense. Don't need that either. Oh, okay. Please be chill plus. Like a really chill plus six. I don't think they'll give you a six. There's probably more upgrades after this. I guess the highest I've seen was five. Or five. Okay, let's go back in here. Hey, look, there's still a chest there, <laughs> which I never got. Oh, is this is not the place. I don't think this is the place. I can get this chest. Poison. Poison. Plus. Poison. 
So I am confused. Where was that located? Oh, it's here. Oh, it's here. Oh, it's one. I got the, uh, I just got the second one. If that's the one, I don't know. Is there a third one? I'm waiting for Scotty. That's all I can say. I don't, um, hopefully I at least get one copy. Well, not copy, but, you know, actually get Scotty. I'm still sad I didn't get Hokusho. Hokusai. The one that I can aggro. Oh, please. Plus. Confuse resist. Oh, yes. I can use that. I think I can use 5%. That's a good upgrade. Oh, wait. Actually, that could be very helpful. Or series is. I can give it to myself. I... Well, debuffer is just what the same thing, right? I don't think I have a second debuffer. I could have a 65% chance. Give you one. Because we know this boss likes to aggro range should be less. Damn, it's still. Oh, well, let's try it anyway. Oh, did you show cash? <laughs> I'm curious to know what's this reaction. <laughs> Let's go double healing. Oh shit! I did not want to do that. Fuck.
I don't know how the daze doesn't work. She still does it though. I should I should use the uh, double earth or something. Oh wow, really? Yeah. Uh, maybe we should have gone double earth. You can do the same attack again. Uh, I shouldn't have done double healing, I should have done double earth like before. At least it mitigates the huge damage. The only problem is that the knockdown base you get instant kill. I guess I can give myself a uh, base resist? Oh no, it's topple, huh? Topple resist. I'll give myself topple resist. That way I can quickly go in. Heal, save her before, before um, she it gets killed. So it has to be top of the zip. Yeah, but if I mind blast, yes, that is true. Actually, I should put it on her. Huh? Put top of blue. I want HP up at least. I hide from one attack. Hopefully, I have okay. I have top or resist reason. Um, we don't want. I'm not gonna use lightning. I'm gonna go. To, the only problem with mind blast is the fact that um. I gotta hope I can use it by the time he does it. That's the only thing. Again. And this time we're gonna go double um, Earth. How did I get aggro? Get away from me. He's doing it. Oh, my God. 
the couple resist is helpful, so. And fuck you. Oh, I can't even use this either, seriously. 50 50 chance that I lost it. Hey, at least Dana didn't lose. Hey, at least I got the, the, the healing buff up. I'm saving my thing. Ah, perfect timing. Give me poison. Oh, fuck it, drop. Revenge is almost complete. God damn it. Die, come on. Just die for the die. Oh, yes. Finally deleted. <laughs> oh man, that was a t that was still a tough fight even at that level. That double earth really really helped a lot still, and and anti uh, anti topple, that helped a lot. I think that's the key right there. Uh, topple uh, complete topple immunity. I think that's the key, sir. Honestly. Uh, what the hell does I have? Oh, debuff resist. Oh, I didn't have debuff resist, that's why. I was wondering why I had didn't have a chance to... Woo! Finally did it though. You never really need to change your setup in Xenoblade. Well, there really isn't much though in Xenoblade 2, right? I don't think- I don't remember. Honestly, I don't remember much. All I know is you need- you just need to have uh, blades you can use as part of your um, game style, gameplay style. That's it. You don't have to change things to defeat specific things like boss the- Oh, okay. That, that's fair, I guess. I'm saving. We'll see what this boss does and when I'll work around with it. Oh, there it go. Oh. Is that NM? Oh shit, NM is back. Kill it. <laughs> we'll go double healing. Yeah. <laughs> 
Perfect. Wow, Nene, is that... I saw that bop. I saw that bop. Ah, oh, dang. Where does this do? I don't think this was open before, was it? Oh my god, another one for Shulk. Well, now he can definitely- Wow, that's a huge jump. Now he can definitely upkeep the Monado. It's not an NM, even though... I mean, get first. Blade 2 was fun, but I didn't like the blade uh, gotcha system. I never got Cosmos. That's like the biggest joke f from my street. Every everybody I know, all my friends, they got co Cosmos. I didn't get Cosmos, so and I burned everything I had um, from the beginning to the end. You know, from the beginning I started playing again to the end, and I never got Cosmos. <laughs> it's kind of messed up. Not like a need to her, but still, it's like, it's kind of like, you know, sad. Very sad. Okay, yeah, this is like a very evil looking location. Okay, let's see how bad it is. It's probably a giant spider, huh? They're gonna come down from me? I'm glad I got the, the blades I got actually worked with my playstyle. So it was very, very. I mean, if I play Xenoblade 2 again, I'm afraid, like, you know, the HD version or whatever, you know, let's say they make it a, a thing. I'm afraid that. I mean, I don't care about custom. I just would like to get the same blades I had before. <laughs> because it really fits my uh, style of the ga my gameplay. It's a shame just now voiced. Oh my god. It was like Indiana Jones right there. Okay, um... 
definitely double earth. Definitely double earth. <laughs> We're going defensive. Mill you. Is this like the Abyssal whatever level 120? Holy shit! And Spike too. What kind of Spike is it? I don't even know what the fuck is Spike. Cheshire Gun double. Oh fuck. An anti topple. Okay, we're going double heal. Oh shit. That's the ether damage right there. Okay, so we're going, uh. I gotta go anti-topple again. I'm keeping the buff reason. So we're gonna remove chill plus. No, ether plus. Um, for you... I would like to have more HP. Again, he's still missing boots. Actually, I still lost HP, so he shouldn't. He should. HP up, heart seal, resist, the couple. Oh god, 18%. I'm saying at this point, we might as well give HP. So we're going double healing. Double heal. Oh, man. This is tough. And spike damage, too. That's another problem. I don't know what the hell's the spike. I don't know what the hell's the spike. Give use. It didn't really affect me much, so I'm not too worried, honestly. At least from what I've seen. Yeah. Shoot. Oh, didn't there a sound? I thought it was a uh, sight. I feel stupid. Looking in the wrong direction this time. Yeah, this is the level 120 dragon. Auto.
Really? Come on. Then one must stop. Wow, oh, nice save, holy shit. What? Okay, it's over. You're not killing me, man. The flame zither, that's the thing. I think I should run far away, I think I should be okay, but... Or... Actually, I have an idea. Actually, I have an, a, a huge idea. I don't know if it'll work, but it could work. Uh, screw. And that's not too hard, actually, honestly. And then I'll just play the de uh, defensive right here. Oh, wait. Wait, how much damage was that? Not enough HP? 5.38. Okay. I definitely don't have the. HP to survive that hit. I guess I don't have them. Or maybe I should just go double defense because it seems like it seems like it's okay. <laughs> Let's try double defense. Yeah, fire breath is eater damage. I'm not worried about that, honestly. It looks like it's a one-time thing. What the hell? Four thousand. Okay, I need I need a little more HP. I definitely need a little more HP. Even a double H, a double Earth is not enough. And I think he still have a level of vintage too, so... Okay, um, forget chill plus. As much as I like that extra HP, it's not gonna help. Uh... <laughs> I don't think we need debuff reason. Oh, give me a little more HP up. <laughs> there we go. Oh, wait. Wait, I'm already capped. What do I have? Uh, yeah, that's not good. Um, let's see. I can give myself... A little more... Physical part. Just add a little more defense. See, just so. Or I can always cheese it. You know cheesing will work. I don't want to.
That works. Why did my healer get over there? Why? Wow, what's this spamming tail all of a sudden? Uh, yeah, top orders is definitely will be extremely helpful. This is the first me spamming tail like non-stop. Okay. In that case, we're gonna change a little. We'll go, go back to the healing. I think that's a little more consistent. Then I don't have enough HP to take the hit unless. This helps Kino out a little bit. Wait, how'd I get it? Yeah, I don't have enough HP. Yeah, um, I need either a little more armor or HP, definitely. Here, oh, it's a, I can't stop that. And probably topple resist, so we'll work, we'll work on that. We'll work on that. Ah, uh, that sucks. Uh, who cares? Probably better gems too. It doesn't help I'm getting RNG gems. That's the first HP up four I see. to win <laughs> I could cheese though actually I'm curious to see shoot I should have saved that was HP 4 ah honestly I don't know what spike does I, I still can't I still can't tell Uh Sorry Millie, I need I need your gear. Wait, do I really need that much support? There goes my HP up four, sadly. Well, oh, actually, I don't need. I'm cheese. Assuming it works. Unless the game crashed again, like an asshole.
<laughs> Team it in. <laughs> This is dumb! Spike okay, it's a spike type. This is seriously dumb. Oh fuck. What? I was not far away. I can't even hit him! Uh, five, okay, well technically it is a UM, so you should add these three more levels to it. So he's probably in the red. Yeah, okay, well. No, I can beat with Millie. It just, it's just... I can beat with Millie, it's just... You gotta remember UM are stronger than their, the levels say, so... I add like three levels to make it a little more accurate. It was about 83, so I was shipping in the red, which is why I was taking so much, missing a lot with um, Shulk. I'm sad at this port because I don't think. Well, get it. I get it. Nope. <laughs> oh God. I am. Ah, oh, I can't believe I missed ice. That was sad. That is ridiculous. Oh, I could. Uh, reflection would work. Reflection is a uh, breath. I think no, it should work. And I think he has, well, his back-to-back -back tail is kind of a bitch. The reflection might be... Yeah, I'll probably use reflection next time. Uh, there's really nothing else to do. So much stuff to mine. Love to mine. But we're gonna progress a little bit. What is happening over there?
and not come back? Shulk. The fog beasts were meant to be confined within Alchemoth. I don't think that's where those ones came from. What do you mean? The rift made normal monsters transform into fog beasts. Oh. What is matter? The Armus could turn into fog beasts. Meh, meh! No one to picture that! Must hurry to rescue! Oh, are you kidding me? More new gear now? Damn it. Ah. <laughs> uh, he needs shoes anyway, so we'll buy this one. I'm broke. So bad. was right, Melia. Yes. Although, the Rift's influence is spreading far too quickly. Radson, are you fine? Miss Melia, these arm moves. It was so sudden. You can explain later. Let us do the fighting here. You should seek refuge. Right you are. Thank you for that. Was everyone all right? Yeah. No major injuries to speak of. All thanks to you, of course. Kino accepts year supply of sweet wasabi as reward. Real hereupon never has compensation. Where it say that? Shulk. Was it the Rift's expanding influence that's responsible for our Armu's transformation? Looks like it. We saw it happen before, too. Regular monsters turned into fog beasts, just like that. That suggests more fog beasts will appear if the rift continues to spread its vileness. Consider, with the size it was before, the rift's effect was limited to the area within the capital. But now it's getting wider. One moment. In that case, if the rift keeps growing larger, 
All monsters everywhere could be changed by the fog. We must find a way to fight back. We'll need those research notes for that. Let's head for the lab. Right. Well damn poison plus. I'm adding that. That is just too tempting. Uh, question is, how do you earn enough, like, enough money? Because the quest, even though the quest gives a lot of money, just not enough to. Equip everybody because that makes a pretty good, big difference, too. Aside from gathering all the shinies and selling it, So the dragon is is attack spike, so that's not too big of a deal for Melia. And well depending on how I If I go double if I go healing that up then is that an enemy? There's actually enemies now? Holy crap. Yes. If I go healing stance, then the spike damage is not gonna be. Uh, it's not gonna affect um, the gangster pawns much. Gangster pawns, if any at all. You know what does those uh, fog beasts reminds me of? That Zelda Twilight. The Twilight Shadows.
Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah. Wait a minute, why am I doing that? It's nice to get gems from the ether thing now, but it's just kind of annoying you're getting RNG stuff like that. Bike defense, not bad. I could definitely use that too. Holy god.
too RNG-ish to get gems that can help you, honestly. So I'm probably just gonna go for like HP, defense, you know, anti-top and all that stuff. You know, something that can help a lot. Oh, heat sink. Oh, sweet. That helps. Oh, sweet. That's great. I'm safe before I make that same mistake again. I don't know what the hell. A bastard stealing stuff that does not belong to you. Oh my god, that's just funny. Hey, come on, there's a bunch of uh, gangster pawns right there. Level quest, isn't it? That is definitely a low ass level quest. Is that above me or under? It's above me. Shoot. Oh, oops.
Where's she? She doesn't feel right. Oh, that's underground. Never mind. Wait, why would the fish be here? Oh, just items. Okay. Oh, Dawn smile. Why is there no more fish? No, it has to be around junks. Not here. Oh, let's see what's this one. Oh, just to turn it in and turn it. I'm surprised you get this quest now. It's like so low level. It's an easy quest. an asshole.
This one can't complete it. So we continue on. And I think it was 83, huh? So one, two, seven levels higher. Villain, what do you want? You stand in the way of a new age dawning. Sis, I'm scared. It's all right. I'll protect you, and I'll work, I swear. Behold. The widening rift in the sky. It's proof definite the world abhors you. Spare me your ravings. Oh, Lady Melia, the hope of our race. Gelgar, what is this treachery? As you can see, I am sweeping away some pebbles. Their research is blasphemy against the commingled blood. Don't you comprehend the import of what you're interrupting? The very future of our race hinges on their work. You think this is the future? This reactionary struggle to revive what is long buried? The future of the Hyentia is us. We are what the race ought to become. We are the true face of the High Entia. If not for our ancestors, we would never even have drawn breath. Ancestors? I recognize them not. You, Lady Melia, are our progenitor. You were our beginning, and you will be our future. Senseless drivel. If you would interfere with this research for the sake of spouting your nonsense, you do not deserve my mercy. Melia. Why won't you understand? Why won't you accept that we are the ones destined to lead? You will not so easily refute our history! So be it! I reject you! I will take the mantle and become father of our kin! I will take dominion over all, and the world will be yours to rise! I know I am not wrong. I'm not. I will spare you. Just be gone from my sight. No! The lab! Melia! Miss Melia! No! Idiot! <laughs> 
crown is mine now. Talon! Vixus, help! Better safe than sorry. The pure blood meets its end today! Are you okay, Talon? Telethia, here! Damn! She's okay. She's all right. I'm sorry. I couldn't save. <gasps> the future. went up in flames, so we carried you here. The lab. <gasps> I'm sorry, Teelan. I failed you. Miss Malia. You damn fool! What possessed you to do that? What happened to safeguarding the future of the Hyentia? And bringing our brethren back home were those just words to you? You should think long and hard about what the death of a leader would mean for us! Come on, big sis. That's enough! Don't defend her. This idiot child! I had to. What? To protect it at all cost. The research. How can you be so fixated on that? Our salvation lies therein. I believe it now. Melia! And yet... Ultimately, it was for naught. I caused trouble for everyone. And I couldn't even save the documents. Poor oh, Miss Melly. That's not true. If you and your friends hadn't come when you did, there might not have been anything left of the research to continue with. And also... Here. What's this? It's the book you carried out of the fire. Ring any bells? <gasps> this tome? We found it in the tomb? Yeah. The book that started my research. If we have this, me and Tyrea can carry on with our work. Sis, are you with me? Uh, yes, right. We can study the problem until we make some headway. Miss Melia, thank you. Likewise. Teelan, Tyrea. You've only just woken up. Come on. We'll let you rest. Yes. Thank you. What that for? Can I use triple snooze for sea sweet dreams that seem extremely excessive? <laughs> <laughs> This might just be what we need to defeat the Fog King. Yeah. Feeling better? Yes. Much better now. What a relief! Miss Melly, good as new. Kino saved day again. Less braggy, please. Friends, I'm sorry I worried you. And I abused your hospitality. Please forgive me. No. You saved this place and we owe you, big time. This was the least I could do. I will not stop now. I swear to do what I can for the good of Grandel. I appreciate it. Just... don't go running yourself ragged for us. I promise.
We seem to be missing Tyrea. Oh, if you're looking for her, she figured the fog beasts might strike again, so she went out on patrol. The likes of us aren't exactly trained for battle, so really, any help is welcome. You're right. I feel sorry for any beasts that wander into Tyrea's path. <laughs> By the way, did I hear you mention something about defeating the Fog King? All thanks to our friend's research. Is that so? Quite. A sterling achievement, Teelan. Just an accident. Still, even so, your devotion to your mother may well have saved our future. <laughs> All right. What do we have to do? How do we defeat the Fog King? We found ether attacks effective against fog beasts, but not against the Fog King. That's because the ether's concentration was too low. Concentration? Concentration? Pipe down when adults talking, dum dum. Why can't I so bored? The whole thing got me wondering. Why did fog beasts appear when the rift got wider? I think. The intensity of the rift's rays exceeded the density of the Telethia's ether field. Um, none of that makes any sense to me. How is the density connected to the Fog King? If we could put up an ether field denser than the Telethia's, the Fog King will become vulnerable. How does one put up an ether field? Secondly, where does one obtain such highly concentrated ether? For the field. I think this guy will do the job, with a little tinkering. In that case, it's just a matter of gathering up enough high-purity ether crystals, except... Except what? Those kinds of ether crystals are extremely rare. I'm not sure where I'd even start looking. There might be none at all around here. Oh, cheer up, all of you. It is not a foregone conclusion, and in any scenario, if we cannot defeat the Fog King without them, we will have to keep looking until we find them. Hmm, true enough. Good. Then let us start by asking around. Hey! Hey, okay.
Are you that? Welcome. Welcome. Are you that? Hey, okay. Uh-oh. 
Yeah, another and then new one too. Go go healer route. And the King Sunny. Wow, what timing? Wait, what? How? Did he fall for something? Want something good? Ah, thing.
Oh god, I thought that was a mushroom from Secret Mana. For a second. Okay, that's a lot, so hopefully I should be able to get a upgrade. Hello. Let's go armor first. Ah, shoot. Where's the actor? Where's the other person? Him? Oh, him. Yes. Where's that guy? Oh, don't tell me it's a one-time thing. That's... Not this person. Hi there. Oh, God. Maybe he shows up at night? Just before the um, monster fight, there was actually a uh, guy who was selling a, a lot of high-end gear, but I didn't have the money that time. Now I do.
Let's swim to that direction. I seriously doubt he's there though. But so it should have showed up on the map even if you don't explore that area. Oh, never mind. I was wrong. That's all. Maybe specific gears. Like, it's specific. Oh, never mind. Shit. He, they are selling it. Okay. Uh, tank first. Um. Oh, maybe I did buy this one for her. Yeah, I took it. Maybe they don't sell. Them. Yeah. Okay. Shocked him. I'm not wearing this one. Get this one from Leo. Can't. But this was not everything, just something. Rafalga says the better set. The the going's the better one? Yeah. This is probably wise. Then we'll give him the uh whatever is left over stellar. Wait a minute, I don't think that was a good idea. 50% axe. Here can be, I don't know what the hell I put here. So just hold off for now. Yeah. 
Break down, I don't think that will make a difference. We'll keep aggro up. Um. Like the. I thought it was on everything when healing or attacking. I would assume see that's it's a pat I know I know art art aggro I mean art stealth is only on um only only work well Honestly, I have no idea, honestly. But yeah, double attack on it would actually be a very good idea. That's a very good idea. That is a very good idea. I'm so angry I missed the uh, HP up 4. Now I'm just trying to get the RNG to give it to me again. <laughs> Which kind of sucks. So many wasted gems because of this. I'm misremembering. I, I don't know, honestly. I mean, I, I, I have no idea. I have no idea, honestly. Gonna see. Hey, I'm not getting anything. I'm not finding anything at all. Let me sell the Hello. stuff we don't need. Go down. Okay. Um. I either. I still want to take this. It's automatic. Yeah, seventy-eight would make sense. Recommended level seventy-eight. That way, you would actually be able to hit the damn dragon because of the level difference. And them. I think. It's raining also. <laughs> Yeah. 
Ah, lame. Uh, forbidden. Seriously, that's like Twilight Princess. That's Twilight Princess. Like defense board. Actually, what gents we need? We need green for the topple. Welcome. Donate your body? Oh no. I think this one is ice. Oh, just right there's the wind. The wind is. Weird. I think this is. No, oh no, that's in no, no, it's inside the the place where I had ogre. Couple reason. Give me like five or level six. Topple up. This one still can't clear, so we'll continue. Actually, we can try this again. We can try this again. Just, just for a lot. Oh wait, wait, wait. HP, HP. One HP HP R2. Come on, god dang it. Oh, come on. Oh, fuck. Uh, I'll this one. Then we can read one more. 
And then here, let's go. Ah. Oh, that's right. Let's go either. I'm going to see if I can go with the, um, uh, I'm going to see if I can, uh, how do you say? I'm going to see if I can. He does should be more than that. He needs. stuff from me on 18 Let's get there first and I'll try. I'm gonna use reflection to avoid the tail. But we'll see. I don't know if it'll work. Oh, yeah, I am one level higher. Or maybe I should just go with double earth again. We don't need that. Our reflex. That burst then will go mind blast. I don't think I'll win. Uh, he has 83. Definitely. I'm going to water. Oh my god, I want to go push him off. Your will to battle is burning bright. Not 
That'll be funny if you can. Come on, really? You know what? I should not should have used my uh, audio. Ah, uh, that ether thing. Okay, I think I'm gonna try double double healing. I don't think it'll. Promise, I'm gonna take a lot of damage. That's the. One. I think that keeps me alive. Or maybe a uh Gosh, what is that? Oh, yeah, I can't I, I can't. Uh, okay. Wow, already? Oh, that's a huge change. But I guess we just stick with Earth. Yeah, just stick with Earth. I just, um... I just need to save my reflection for the thing. The only problem is knowing when it uses it. That's the only problem. Even have to topple. Did it, my HP is the levels keep keeping my HP from as I would like it to be. Again? No fair! Yeah, okay. We'll just do this later again. The damage is way too hot. And he can spam it that quick, I didn't... That's just... Well, another thing is that the level difference gives him much more damage and makes my defense much less too, so. If I'm at least 80, or 83, which is pretty much equivalent to what he is, it shouldn't be that big of a deal, I don't think. What's up?
78. Well, that's the recommended level, so I guess it does match up with the um that matches that does match up with the uh oh you're up there. Well, Melia? I thought you used. I thought you dropped Melia. Keep falling down. Yeah. I mean, if I use Shulk, I'm sure I can do just the same. I mean, I mean, the only the key with Shulk is just throwing armor non-stop. Honestly, that's all you need. The 75 damage reduction is like. Versus uh, Melia's 30% reduction is huge. Not to mention armor I also re uh, re uh, protected from ether and uh, you know ether damage also. Reload my other one. The only problem with the stroke one is the fact you can't hit him because of the level difference, that's it. Other than that. Oh, I might want to add spike damage. I don't think topple is going to matter. Topple shouldn't be a big deal. Stroke. Reload. Oh, oh, actually, I can level. Oh, then I know shields maxed out, it won't matter. I'm, just... I'm armor. The mu area music gives me two times vibe. Makes two vibes, really? Oh, actually, that er that that place I uh, that world that actually reminds me of one of the world in uh, X two. You're right. HP. Gotcha, do I even need it? Uh, do I have any more double attack? Or is that the best I got? Do I have any other haste or is that the best one I got? It is, okay. Oh, I forgot Spike, go on. This is the problem right here. The freaking missing. I should maybe should add agility or something. And there's no night vision either. I wish I had a jelly. 
the long enduring fight here. Maybe I should add agility. Look at that shit. <laughs> it doesn't do anything! Cheesy Monado skills! This is this is why I didn't want to do it like this. Shield thing, God. Yeah, bitch. Oh, fuck, I missed. Come on. Where's my hands? Come over here. Miss, 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 miss. I really should add agility. This is cute. Yeah, I know, but that's. It didn't matter. Jelly didn't matter. I mean, not jelly. Tension didn't matter. You're already low in the in terms of uh, because of your level difference, you're already going to be missing no matter what. So it just reduced even further on. Oh, it's a tension reducing spike? We don't need... Let's do this. This is the second time I've seen this. Alright, we got this. Yeah. 
Uh. Come on. He was like, doing anything for a long ass time. I was like, what? I thought I bumped him. I was like, yo, that's so cool. Damn it, so close. Oh, now I got enough. You know, I think I'm going to ignore the, um, topple. I'm going to add agility and spike. Topple's not a pro problem on The level difference hurts like hell though. I need a spike defense more than her. What the hell is gonna add? 
Oh god, that's not mine. Where is night vision? Where the hell's night vision? Oh my god, night vision will be so helpful here. I think I won't be able to much. Oh, sh That should be fun. I'm not going to lose tension, but I'm still going to miss like hell, which would still hurt me. On hit! See, the miss is, is killing me. Because of level difference. It's like I'm finding 83, which is... Red? I think it should be red. Thank God! Holy God! Thank you. 
I should have stick with healing, honestly. I probably should have stick with regen. He's double tech. Damn it. There's not much I can. Ah, it's... Need. I really have no choice. Uh, the mist is the problem. Any the missing. Anything else I can put on here? Drop one top or recovery up. Yeah. yeah, we're sticking with HP. Agile. And I'm sticking with that. Now, at least help me a little more in um, trying to hit the game. I should have saved the game. Just these killing Oh, actually, we can get Jilly down work. We're working to get Jilly down where I can actually hit him. I have a plan now, much better. Than that. I never thought of, I forgot about the jelly down. That would that helped a lot too. I'm stick. I'm just staying like this, man. I don't care. I'll have the gangster party. There you go, Julia down again. Oh, I See? Like I said, Julie was the key. The little st spike defense idea was a good idea, was a really good idea too. It looks be attacking me. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't see you hit Jelly Down. I'd use it? I'm gonna wait. If I fail this time, I'm gonna add a lot of agility. Ding. Agility down on attack on uh, on both the tank, the tank and healer. That way I can uh, hopefully keep it up, up the agility down so I can actually hit them. Without vision, is you gotta really preempt this skill, otherwise you can take a lot of damage. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Oh damn it. Oh fuck, it's on. Oh. Okay. Well, at least, um. Get the agility thing. Wait, how the hell? Wait! Who's dropping to- oh, it's probably the- oh. Can you stack it to increase the chance? And chance to- So 25 percent. Oh, it's always gonna be 20 percent. 20 percent is pretty high. Let's see what this.
You don't need. It's hard to know what the skills gonna use too. Which is kind of dumb. And I think if I stay behind him, I don't get hit by the tail. Maybe. Yeah, I don't get hit by the tail. I stay behind. And if you stay behind the accuracy, is this kind of good too? Oh, better not crash. by Gang Palms. 
Oh my god. Can you imagine if I was on the edge? I thought that he would have pushed me off. <laughs> Yep, the cheese armor. Yeah, that jelly down was so helpful. Stacking all that jelly down. Seriously, the armor is so broken that I didn't even need the uh, 5,300 HP threshold to survive the attacks. <laughs> At least the tail swap. Yeah, I need about almost 5,000 to survive the fire. No, about 5,000. No, almost 6,000 to survive the fire too. Well, the armor struck would have died so many times. Oh, this stuff looks expensive as X. <laughs> oh god, that's funny. If sell all this, we'll definitely make pink. <laughs> 
Gangster Pond. Wow. Oh, it's a heavy. Wait, Mel can equip heavy gear now? Wait, wait, wait. This prize is crowd that the pond spec that the gangst uh, gangster pond had given you is a headpiece especially familiar. We're in battle and you're sure to feel the gangster pond spirit surging through you. Oh shit. Oh sweet, I screenshot that. Wait a second, I'm gonna make a copy of that. <laughs> yeah, save as PNG. We'll call it Gangsta Pawn. Gang the Pawn. Okay. I guess you can go back to aggro. I seriously doubt there's gonna be any other enemy that will be that absurd. Well, I hope there isn't. Honestly, I don't remember what I had on her, so we're just gonna. Do this. And after this, I'm gonna add. Where's that? Is this fail save? We're gonna add debuff resist 50. Um, we'll just keep her. This. Yeah, everybody else is fine. Wait. No art, no AP, really? Oh, come on. You give us some AP. Oh. Oh, we can skip through these talking. Uh, yeah. What's up? We gotta fight something, so it's a whole- I wonder if that helmet actually does have some special effect, or is it just all talk? That's what I'm curious to know. Can I help you? 
So it looks like tomorrow I'll be beating I'll be finishing the game, huh? I have less than an hour, so I don't think I will be able to finish it. I don't think there's any other quest I'm gonna be bothering doing. Well, you know, at least I don't think there is. I still want to see all of those um, heart to heart like things. The turtle up. Seriously, the next uh, Xenoblade, they need a, a gangster pawn. Seriously, this is just fun seeing all these little gangster pawns follow you around and kicking ass. It's fun, it's just fun. Okay. It's just fun. Electric. Oh, we'll just get. Oh, well, day's resistance good. We need like a hundred little gangsta pawn. I love no pawn except Tatsu. Who's Tatsu? Who's Tatsu again? Is that one of these guys? No, it can't be. Yeah, well, I know Touch is a no pawn, but I'm just trying to remember where. Tatsu is nothing. Oh, sweet. We finally got this. Oh, come on. Golden yeah. bracelet like that evoke Valk Mountain. And oh, so you wear it as a knight. It's gonna have that little beam thing. Oh, wait, is he one of the playables? He's from X. Let's see this. I'm curious to know. Wait. wait who the hell can wear it? Yeah. Of I want to see if it actually glows or is it lie? Like a light beam, like in Valak Mountain. A lot. Wait, oh, that's right. <laughs> this is. It's just a. Uh, what a shame. It does not. It lied. Well, I mean, unless you need a whole gear gear set, you'd be on it. The only thing I remember from X is black tar. But that's it. Oh, I would love to play it X remake or something. Yeah, let's listen to Black Tar again. Okay, I was there already.
Um, can you, is anyone able to tell me like how far am I to it finishing? Oh, sweet. Or am I still quite a ways? Pretty close? Will I be finishing in 30 minutes or not? Well, I don't need, well, side quests, probably not, because I don't think there's any, um, any more upgrades. But I would still like to get all the heart-to-hearts. Like what? I mean, how many more is there? A oh, quiet moments. One. Oh, wait. We, okay, we did that one. Oh, this one too. So there's uh, quite a bit left. I would definitely would like to do it. So now what we need to do is... Modify the weapon to incorporate the crystals. Mm. Ransom, sir! Fog beasts have broken through the gates! They're through! <sighs> if only they'd waited a few hours. Shulk, defending Grandel is our priority. Follow me. Right. We shall deal with the intruders. You get the villagers to safety. Okay. Teelan, you stay put. Gotcha! There's more cuts in the gameplay left at this point. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I guess after this part, when it's time to go back to fight the Valking, I'll check all the heart to heart, then beat it, I guess. We're here to help. This rabble won't stand a chance, not against the big one. We'll keep the small fry off your back. All right. You go no further. Yeah. Please, for life is no use. Kino make you full of holes. And Nene teach you better manners. You know what? This is the NM in the uh, mountain too. Oh shit, I didn't fix this. I forgot to fix my art. Why is that giving me the little icon? Seal the gates. We beat them this time. But the numbers are against us. I hate to say it, but if you'd already left when the attack happened, we'd be smoke. Fog King must go! Down with Fog King! Situation is tough. I agree. Melia? I'll do it. I will bring the companions back to lend you aid. They won't agree. You know they despise us. They must see the danger. They will understand what needs to be done. Yea, as soldiers of the High Entia, they know it's their solemn duty. Hmm. Huh. 
I swear it. I will bring them back with me. Please. Trust me, Ratsum. I'll be right here. Trusting and waiting. Tyrea. Yeah, yeah. Hurry up and go. But I haven't even... Defend this place until I return. Those are your orders, right? Though we're short-handed as it is. Will you be okay? Just go, before I change my mind. Thank you. We'll be quick. Movement! Multiple biggins confirmed! Impossible! More already! <sighs> if the rift grows any wider than it is now, Grandel is lost. We must hurry. Come, follow me! You head straight for the Cape. What are you saying? This will take all of us. I know exactly what my orders are here. I hope I don't have to remind you what yours are. But that's... You said it yourself. If the rift grows any wider, there's no way we'll be able to hold this place alone anyway. This is our last chance to enlist the Companion's aid. Tyrea. Radzam is trusting you with this. Now you put your trust in me. Come on, we make for the Companion's Cape. That's all of them. We're in the clear. Breathe deep, men, and prepare for the next wave. Let's go through this again. Hi, Entia, deploy your shields. Stop the advance on the gates. Anyone with a rifle, clean out small targets in range. Remember, all we're here to do is buy time. Eliminating all threats is not our mission. Make no mistake. Mom! Oh. Fog be sighted! To arms! They're all just... gone. What? But how? How are you? All well? 
Yeah? What the hell are you? Never you mind that. We've come to make a request. Time is of the essence. Go on. Would you return to Grandel? If you're asking like that, I assume you know why we left. Indeed. Then you must know why that's not an option. What if I said, Grandel is besieged by fog beasts? Are you serious? I'm far too busy to come here just to lie. And the villagers? Are they safe? Yes. For the time being. But not for much longer. You don't seem all that surprised, Maxis. No. I didn't know. Just connecting the dots. If we were it, then... Well, I trust I needn't spell it out for you. A veteran of the Guard. You need not. But it's not as simple as you make it out. I never said anything about simple. But you did ask. You forget yourself, Maxis. Do I now? What matters here is that the lives you have been guarding are once again in danger as we speak. Yes, but... You're free to have your reasons. But you need to find a way to accept reality and move forward in your life. Hmm. Maxis, we are the lucky ones. What do you mean? We can go home. That's nonsense. The Fog King has Alchemoth. Yes, but our home is right there, even if we cannot live in it now. But what of the other refugees? To them, home is gone. Even if they could leave, they have no certainty home still exists. But we... left them for dead. How can we possibly... It is never too late to make amends. As long as you live. After all, despite your quarrels, you are neighbors, family. Those bonds can withstand more than you think. Maxis, realize what you have. Do it before it's too late, or you'll regret it. <coughs> Maxis, I'm going with these people. I can't turn my back on them. Maxis? <sighs> you're damn good. All right, I mean. So you're with us? Truly? Yes, but... It wasn't your fancy words that swayed me. My family needs me. Fine. As you wish. Birdman painting bomb bomb. Real feather brain. Okay, can Rick correct me if I'm wrong, but don't they realize she's the queen? Empress? Or they never just seen they never seen her before, so they don't even know she is the leader. Oh. Don't need anything. Um Let's get reflection.
little spoiled princess brat! No sign of Miss Maria yet? Not so far! Sam! Bunch of new hostiles closing in! I guess the lot from the Cape really left us for dead. Miss Tarea, it's all over. Please, pull back. Not just yet. Stand firm. Believe in our brethren. Believe in your new leader. My man, there's only so much you can do. When you see me fall, abandon this place and withdraw into Grand Dell. Victoria! You kept us waiting. You big jerk! Lady Melia! She's back! And it looks like she brought the companions with her! Let's clear a path! Maxis, thank you. Ha! Huh. It's me who should be thanking you, Ransom. If you hadn't spoken out when you did, we couldn't be having this conversation. What are you talking about? If it weren't for your help, we'd all have kicked it ages ago. Is Melly looking for Tyrea? She go back after healing. Cannot put up with this sentimental manure. Was exact words. <laughs> Sounds just like her. To a T. Lady Melia, I'm glad we trusted you. We owe you a debt for our lives. No, you have only each other to thank. Huh? Wait up, huh? Melia? Did he say Melia? Indeed. Surely not. You can't be THE Melia Antiqua. Antiqua? Uh, yes. I do get called that sometimes. I... that... no. What? That means... Your... Your Highness is the Crown Princess Melia. Do you need a minute, Maxis? Impudence! This girl is the true-born child of our late Emperor Saurian, the Imperial successor, Crown Princess Melia Antiqua. Is he telling the truth? It was not my intent to deceive. I thought if I announced myself, it could bring hope, but it could also bring despair. 
What our people need now is hope only. Hence the discretion. I'd appreciate if you treated me normally. Right. That is enough of that. Much work remains, after all. You mean slaying the Fog King? Lady Melia, we companions will form your honor guard. You won't. You companions will join Tyrea and guard Grandel from Fogbeast Incursion. But that's... Listen to me, Maxis. You feel you want to dispel the regrets of your brethren by your own hands. I understand well. But, for the sake of those fallen, you must protect the living. Don't you think that's the best way to use your talents right now? <sighs> the Companion's strength, Grandel's knowledge, Tyrea's will. Without any one of those, the town would be lost. It's the only way. I understand. We accept. Trust us with the ramparts. Thank you. Truly. Lady Melia, take care. Absolutely. Maxis and his companions. They're counting on us, too. Yes. Let us perform the enhancements at Radsom's. May we, Radsom? Ah, oh, only too gladly, Miss Melia. It's ready. Ha! <laughs> what? We've not changed much. Still same. Quite. Well, it was more of a tweak. I don't mind. If it lets us take down the Fog King. Hmm. Theoretically. Finally come time for denouement. Days of Fog King numbered! Well, it is time. Please come back safe. But a rare feast will wait! Tilan, not to cause mischief in meantime, okay? So, you did it. Thanks to you, and to Tilan. Strength and honor, friend. We will do our best. The Fog King is in the villa. You saw it? Yeah. But how will we get in there? I tried to enter several times, but the transporter refused to work. That's because it was set so that only I could activate it. Why? The villa was where I rescued Teelan from the Fog King's clutches before you came. I wanted to seal it off and trap the monster inside. Except... The transporters, they don't mean a damn thing to it. Still, it seemed better than nothing, so I put it on lockdown. Is that...? I used this for authentication. Take it. I have no need of it anymore. I see. We'll keep guard here, don't worry. Good. I shall count on it. Our race's future is in your hands. Got it? All right. I won't let you down. Well, let's go. Hmm. Nene got friends and friends of friends. That line of hero Ponkino! You brave few who venture forth, we salute you!
sweet Lucino. Uh. Up so sudden. I was just thinking about the cave near Colony 9. Do you know it, Nene? It's called Tefra Cave. Nene, no place. Nene tag along once with group of Hum Hum. Went to fetch ether cylinders. I've done that too sometimes. Went with Ryan a couple of times. Mama, hooray for twinsies. Nene went there during rebuilding effort. So you did your part to help Nene. Thanks for that. It not thing that need thanks per se. Just doing civic duty. Must stay friends and work together. With all peoples that live in world. <laughs> That's right. But folk here have a lot of angry kerskuffles. Fight between neighbors bad. Should watch Nene and Kino. Learn to everyone play nice. Well... I wouldn't say the people here are enemies, exactly. They just... don't know how to work out their feelings. That just... fancy way of saying fighting? It's not exactly like fighting. Both sides do understand each other, but their paths took them in different directions. What Mr. Shock mean? If the two sides had simply hated each other, they wouldn't just leave. They tried to drive the other side out by force. But that's not what they did. They still have common ground to stand on. And Melly is here now. They just need some time to mull things over. Mr. Shulk is a very kind person. Very different from Mama Pon. When Nene and Kino get into bad fight, Mama Pon spank first, then ask questions. Nene and Kino always in tears, but always say sorries and make up with hug hug. End of end, friendship become much stronger. Being friends mean a whole lot more fun, and more fun is more good. Also, everyone in Colony 9 was friends from start of start. Well, that's because everyone there was working to help rebuild. We all share the same dream. But dreams of people here, all really all that different from each other. For now, I guess. But Melly is doing the best she can, and we need to as well. Nene understand. Nene will wait until Miss Melly and make dreams of everyone mush together as one. But if dream of Miss Melly not go through to everyone, in that case, Nene will... Nene will... And no one's spared, even not Mr. Shulk! What? Me as well? <laughs> Just promise to be gentle. Shape of things that are to come. Like fuzzy shape of King of Fog thing? <laughs> no, even beyond that. Mm -hmm. When this is over, when the battle is won, what will you do? <laughs> Miss Mally asks good question. 
Kino goes straight home and reports such seedings to Thelabon. Hmm. What will you tell him? That Miss Rally and others make best of sidekicks. Sidekicks? Kikino mean friends, or a slip of tongue. Miss Rally bees, no scary face. <laughs> Just a joke. Mama, please not to intimidate Kino. You wish to be a hero upon, yes? If that was enough to startle you, you've got a long way to go. Mama. And yet, I hardly think you need to feel hurried. This journey we're on is a certain first step on the way to achieving your dream. I know you will have many chances to prove yourself yet. Also, I think you've got a very fine figure pursuing your goal. Oh, then Kino already want to hear about <laughs> if you're asking that question, it's a sign you are not. Miss Melly make no sense sometimes. What will you do after you speak to Ricky? Mama, what Miss Melly mean? As laudable as it is to have made new friends, surely it is but the first step to herodom. Mama, sidekick... Oh, friends is all Kino thought of so far. After Dad of them come back from adventure, he boldly brag about bring back many friends and have great success. So then, Kino also want to tell about how Kino make friends, but not enough reason to want. What really counts is inside you, but you still have much time. Perhaps it would do you good to think on it a while. Miss Molly not just tell? Miss Molly such a meanie. Also, what is mean by still have much time? You not go back once King of Fog goes, Bosh. You are forgetting something. The junks is quite severely damaged. I expect we can repair it. But it will not happen overnight. Nah, that did slip mind. But everyone expects big return of Hero Bon Kino. What Kino going to do? Have ambitions. Want travel to far, far land. Talk to many much people. And then helping wing if some in distress. What to doing? What to doing? Magnificent plan of Kino encounter unplanned delay. Miss Molly, please to help in Kino. <laughs> I see you've taken my words to heart. Mama, what Miss Molly mean? To think it was only a little while ago you were hiding behind Nene. You've come very far in such a short time. Helping those you encounter, no matter the problem. You've become quite forthright in our travels. Indeed, striving to make your dreams come true is a powerful thing. Now, so Miss Melly explain? Well, being told the answers does not equal learning. How about this? Why don't we think on it together? Mama! Miss Melly nice to kill her after all. Suddenly get dark. When open eye, 
saw face of huge brog in front of own face. Mimir! Hope it not eat us. Tongue of brog all wormy long. With tongue, it gobble Nene right up. Oh no, Nene get eight? But, but to help Sister Bon, Kino get self ate too. Mare, what happened next? Inside a brog stomach, four pollen orbs. Oh, day of heavy. How very lucky to be brog food. No, wait, how we get out? Kino insist upon a own fill of pollen orbs. Eight till full. It sound like dream. So then, bodies of Kino and Nene swell up like balloon. And brought Black Kino and Nene out. Such wow! Nene and Kino jammy pants. And that how Kino become mighty hero born. Such sudden. Now, what give? Why not Nene become hero born? But, but... What happened? It was just dream. Once woke up, no longer was hero born. Meh. Well, Nene think Kino become more closer to hero upon each day. Kino, while travel with Mr. Shock and Miss Melia, Kino try to talk to all many sorts of people. And also, ancient Nopon art a shifty slip that Kino practiced so long look like it come along nicely. Mama, really? Hurrah! Kino happy to hear. <sighs> Wait! How Nene no Kino is practicing shifty slip technique? Meh, he's not to sweat teensy details. Shifty also. Uh, uh, anyway, Kino working really hard to become hero upon. Which mean, one day soon, become hero upon in life, not just dream. Meh. Mr. Shulk and Miss Melly are such amazing. Always give everything for others. They like real life hero pon. But but what about Kino defeat King of Fog? Could even do all but lonesome. Meh meh. Kino sure? Kino sure. But there no need for Kino to fight by lonesome. Everyone defeat Fog King together. If fight alone. It's always chance to slip up and make mistake. But when all together, help one another to succeed. Nene make sure everyone stay safe. And Kino make sure everyone stay healthy. Mama, Kino convinced? After beat King of Fog, Kino be hero one? For sure, get big pat on back from bird people, friends. And then... Maybe they build statue of Kino, hero upon, vanquisher of King of Fog. Ma, 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 Kino have to do it. Nene always by side of Kino, not have to worry one bit. Oh, thankings. With Nene by side of Kino, King of Fog just me a cloudy puff. Let the spirit. Nene also set pluck to max.
It's a fateful thing. That you and I should see each other again, here, like this. Tyrea, what brought you to the Bionis shoulder? A good question. Honestly, I had no motive. I wandered without aim, the Bionis no more. Before long, I found myself here. That's all. So it is but a work of chance. Is that right? Exactly. Though I certainly didn't expect that chance would bring me back to Alchemal. The rest is just as I told you. I helped Elam with his research and surveilled the city, waiting for the right opportunity. So then, you're saying you remained here in order to win back the capital, yes? If I'm honest, I have to admit I did consider it. At least until the Fog King appeared. And then? The people who still live here, when I showed up, I was a dead woman walking. But they took me in without question. People like that, falling victim to that accursed monster. It doesn't bear thinking about. That's why. You feel yourself indebted to them, right? Tyrea, you've changed. Have I? Have I really? Tyrea, if it's all right with you, why not come with us? Melia. We can't pretend the past didn't happen. I know that. But still, can't we at least band together? I... can't. <sighs> Is... that so? <sighs> Forgive me, Tyrea. It was thoughtless not to consider your feelings. You must see me as your mother's killer. You misapprehend. That's not at issue here. I just don't... understand. What do you mean? What don't you understand? I simply... Since the day Yumea drew her final breath, I've lost sight of the path I should walk. It's still the same now. What can I focus on? Where should I go? What will bring meaning to my existence? Even my staying here, when it comes down to it, I'm just resigning myself to the winds of chance. Tyrea, that's wrong. Melia, you continue to misjudge me. I have not changed. I've never known anything. Not even my own desires. I can tell you feel lost, Tyrea. I've never had anything remotely resembling your brilliance. Everyone, and I mean everyone, feels doubt. We lost sight of the right path in the Great War. We all did, not just you. I did as well. Nay, I still do now. If I said all my doubts were behind me, it would be a heinous lie. <laughs> when your heart is lost at sea and drifting, it takes time to find answers within. And when you've lost someone important to you, it takes more time still. Hear me. You are strong enough. In time, you will find your answers. My skills were once widely recognized. Though I may have used them to try and end your life. Is that still something you wish to do? If that were the case, you would have gone sailing over the edge of the Bionis shoulder a long time ago. <laughs> I believe so too. When in reality, I'm standing here talking with you. So then, I think that leaves us some room for friendship. Doesn't it? <laughs> You speak just like those homs you traveled with. I take that as a compliment, actually. But it's as you say. It's yet another thing I've learned from them. 
Why are you so damn persistent? Is that your crown princess duty? Or do you simply pity the weakling I've become? Enough. I'll hear no more of this self-loathing. <sighs> My heart tells me it's the right thing to do. That is all. That is my reason, and the only answer you'll get. Melia. What's more, Tyrea? You're all the family I have left. <sighs> Listen. Once we have dealt with the matter at hand, would you please give me your answer again? And what if I cannot give you the answer that you're looking for? I will respect whatever conclusion you arrive at, so long as it's one you can live with. Don't get your hopes up. Fine. That will suffice for now. I'll be waiting, Tyrea. Should I really go along with Melia? Am I worthy? After all the years spent in shadows, all the blood. Yumea, mother, please give me a sign. Tyrea, do you perchance remember the day that we two first met? I was wondering what you'd come out with. You finally decided to settle some past grudges, have you? Not at all. I just found it quite moving. Though we crossed blades, contended for our very lives, here we are, standing shoulder to shoulder, gazing out at our shared ancestral home. <laughs> Quite. Getting over all that was... a minor miracle. If someone told me a year ago that we'd be doing this, I'd have carved out their spleen for suggesting it. <laughs> Tyrea, about what I said to you before. Yes? Are your doubts... allayed? Perhaps. Not all of them. However, my answer to the question you posed is more or less ready. Tell me then. Melia, you are the last high entier of Imperial blood. Well, yes, that is true. Although, are you not also... Quiet. You must continue the line. You and none other. You are the light, Melia. You must lead us. Gather our people under your banner. I don't think... I ought to be there for that. Why, Tyrea? What leads you to say such a thing? The fact is, I was an Inquisitor of the Bionite Order. My very existence prescribed by law. 
You know what role the Order played in the Imperial family's history. I hardly need to remind you. Tyrea. Understand. I regret none of the deeds I did for you, Maya. But even so, all that I have done in that life lingers on inside me, a burden I can't escape. All I do is cast a deep shadow on your radiance. As the Imperial Line rises to greet a new age, I will contribute nothing. I'd be a hindrance. How can you hate your own self that much? <laughs> if that is the answer you wish to give me, then it would be wrong for me to speak out against it. But I will say this, Tyrea. Imperial blood yet runs in your veins too, as does the mixed blood of Ahoms. We are no different. How could we be? At this point, it doesn't mean a damn thing. You're wrong. Stop talking. I told you not to get your hopes up. Can it really be your intention to keep blaming yourself? Why? Why won't you turn your eyes to the future? Is this what your mother would have wanted? How dare you! You didn't know, Yumea. You didn't know my mother. <sighs> Meme! Two of you, stop flap traps! Nay, nay. What are you doing here? That question very irregardable. Nene simply observes sneaky light from hiding. Miss Tyrea, Miss Melia, sister upon fight is counterpon ductive. What? It's better to hug and make up blinkety snap. If not, Mama Pon roll up sleeves, then everyone's sorry. Quit, quit this clowning. We are not. Incidentally, Nene is older sister upon, so even in fight with Kino, always make up swifty quick. But, but it's not because Mama Pon scare into submission, okay? Actually, it's what Nene like to call mature attitude. Ugh, just thinking about make old scars and Nene itchy, itchy. But, but anyway, bottom line is fighting is bad. So, now is when please to hug and make up. Go on, say sorry, Sister Pon. What is this thing going on about? Mother, huh? If your mother... If you Yumea were here now, looking at us like this, I wonder what she would say. Hey, don't tell me you're taking it seriously. It's spouting nonsense. Not it! Nene is not saying Nene is Nene! What point is there in talking about it now? There's no way for us to know. She's dead and gone. My apologies, Tyrea. I know you put great faith in her. So I just thought... But it's as you say. I'll admit, I never understood your mother's mind. Even at the very end. <laughs> Yemea's devotion to the Bionite Order was how she honored the Imperial line. And also, how she channeled her woe over our ultimate fate. Her spirit contained no falsehood. I see. Due to the loftiness of her faith, Yumea could be very severe towards both me and herself. I'm sure if she could see me now, Attending at Yumea's side, serving her unto exhaustion was my whole life. Yumea's desires were mine as well. What's more, the blood that flows in me is in essence. Tyrea? Yumea's blood and her will, are they really doomed to just cease to be? Would Yumea really? Would Mother simply allow this? <laughs> hey, 
Whatever has got into you? Melia, if you may were here, if she saw me, saw us too, here's how she'd rebuke us. If you wish a future for the High Entia, you must do whatever is in your power. Huh? Changing one's way of life means negating your past self. I tried to change myself, and the path I walked until then, I disavowed. The precious path I had walked, as you may as loyal retainer. Let me be me then, the Empress's, your shadow, and I'll do what's in my power. So then, you will not change your ways, but still walk alongside me, is that correct? Yamea, mother, kept me by her side for that purpose. She already showed me the road that I should take. I think I'd like to repay her by putting her will into action. For her, and for the future of the High Entia. I see. So that's the answer you have chosen. I'm glad that is your decision, Tyrea. Hmm. You may be a fitting vessel to inherit the throne, but as a politician, you'll be much too soft for your own good. If you got blinded by pretty ideals and came to ruin, I could never face my mother. No, I'd never be so... Let's face it. You'll need someone to rein you in when you get too blinkered. Frankly, I find the suggestion somewhat offensive. All right. But in that case... I must make a pronouncement too. I, Melia Antiqua, Empress of the High Entia, by my name do solemnly decree. Be thou guardian, for our subjects and the race entire, act the mistress of unseen shadows, and pledge thy very life to this throne. Swear your might to my bidding, Tyrea. I accept. I will honor this commission, Your Majesty. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Tyrea, Nene, very proud. Managed to apologize very beautiful. Made your sister bomb vibes. Who, who are you calling sisters? And I'll have you know, I've nothing to apologize for. Meh? But, Miss Tyrea, just a proper big bad to Miss Melia, no? You little... Are you actively trying to insult me? Meh meh? But Bao have plenty sorry feel. It's just like when Dad upon make apologizes to Mum upon. Whatever. I'm too old for this. The future is within our grasp. Sister mine. Oh wow, that was just amazing. <laughs> oh dang. <laughs> Laughing my ass off. That Nene man. Jeez. Go back. Time for my gangsta pawn. <laughs> Melia. Oh, wait a minute, what am I doing? There. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't think I have any other gangsta pawn time. That was great, seriously, that is so much better than the uh, heart to heart in the first game. Then again, I only saw like two heart to heart in the first game. <laughs> That's it, nothing else. The 
is asking for trouble. Look at double. Prepare yourselves. Power a dead upon Okay, how come I don't see that little thing anymore? It's automatic now? Oh shit, I think it's automatic now. You don't have to worry about hitting it perfectly. Oh, never mind. Now it shows it. What the hell? Wait, that was an M? No way. That was not in them, but you get coins apparently. Oh shit, there's another one? I thought I got it. Oh, that's right, there's one more here. I, got, I saw it all. Wait! There's a hidden one? How many turns of beast now and they can give coin oh okay not long now father brother with these two hands of mine I will reclaim Alchemoth hey Melia are you nervous do not worry Shulk I'm just a little heightened. Trembling with excitement, as Dumban might say. <laughs> That's good to hear. I suppose it's no great wonder, though. How about yourself? You've been given a big role to play. Hmm. <laughs> Taking it in your stride, as usual. Well, I've been remembering our time on the Bionis shoulder. It hasn't been easy, but we found the refugees here, got to know Teelan and so on. I'm glad we came. I see. If we can retake the capital, and then get ourselves back to Colony 9, that'll be us sorted. Sorted? Huh? That's right. We're just about there now. We've got this, you know. Hmm. I'm sure. What's wrong? Say, Shulk. Tell me, what are your thoughts on the rift? Hmm? Right. Um... Considering everything we've seen so far, we don't really know all that much about it. I've never seen anything like it. The Fog King, I mean. It's alien to the Bionis and Maconis. Indeed. The Rift is a complete and utter enigma to us. All we know for certain is that its existence poses danger. A wholly new threat for a wholly new world. Sounds ominous. Are my fears unfounded? To be fair, there's a lot about this world that's different. Frankly, it's anyone's guess right now. Hmm. 
Does it bother you? The rift, I mean. I have an ill premonition. Oh? Disaster. Complete ruin. Inescapably looming over our future. I know not why, but that is the vague dread that I feel when I consider the rift. Hey now. I'm sorry. I know we have a big task ahead. I'll try to keep my chin up. It's okay. Your misgivings may just be a weird hunch. Or for all we know, they might come true tomorrow. But there's plenty more we don't know. The future. No one knows it for certain. Mm. Still, that doesn't mean we're entirely helpless. Our actions, they're what shapes the future. We've proven that countless times already. So I think we'll get through this. If we stand together, no power in the world can stand against us. Shulk. I swear, you never change. Oh, uh, sorry. I guess I might have gone a bit overboard. No, I don't think that's possible. I think your words have hit the mark exactly. The future is ours, and it is decided here. All we can do is give our all to build a better one. Indeed, whatever awaits ahead. I seem to be in your debt again. You keep doing this, always helping me when I'm down. <laughs> I didn't really do anything, though. I'm just happy I could lift you up. My thanks. All right, then. We have crucial work to do. Defeat the Fog King and restore Alchemoth, right? <laughs> exactly right. Shall we? Looking awfully foggy today. I would guess it correlates with the widening of the rift. It changes nothing. The time is now. Lend me your strength. The future belongs to us. King of Folk will no name of Hero Bomb Hero! Monster in the proper bashing!
What's wrong? The sky. The rift is expanding. Mama, something not right. Foggy fluffies are coming together. Not take no for answer. What is the meaning of this? It must be drawing its strength from the rift. And now it's even bigger. <laughs> In other words, if we could close the rift, we might have a chance. It's possible. But first, Let's do all that we can here. You're right. This is all over Kino's head. But as hero plan, fight against impossible odds is natural like breathing. My men, time to dish out extra mega serving of this event to cherry on top. Nothing to it. Melee. Your skill is captivating. Oh, 
supposed to do now? Don't give up. No matter how many times it returns, we can bring it down just the same. Our future must be kept safe. What? Telekia? Why? What? What on Bionis? Melia, for whatever reason, those explosions seem to be distorting and destabilizing the rift. Incredible. They saved us. Fine. Time to finish this. Please, buy me some time. Hmm. Me your strength, friends. is safe. Finally. It is.
they're waiting for you, Melia. Does this world need a coronation? I just don't see the point. Don't say that. It is the will of the people. It will mark the birth of a new era. You'd also have been a fine choice. Yes, well. I'm occupied with my research, as you know, Empress Melia. Don't mock me. Here we go. Yes. Wait, are level 12? What the hell? The boss you fight... The so Fog King is... Inferno Gildo? I'm sad I don't remember it at all. Then one? Or... I don't remember that... Is that NM? Boss. I don't, rec I don't recognize the name. Peter Dyer has been a long ass time, I don't remember the name. Oh my god! Ricky's here! Playing with Nene and Kino. <laughs> oh damn, they changed this. That's awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. Okay, I'm trying to remember where that Inferno Guild is from. Oh, shit, and before that. I need a. Wait, what's, why skill? What's the dark? Holy shit, and go up the troll. Wait. Oh, you gotta get the book first? Damn it, I was hoping to see what was the difference. I was hoping I could see the difference. Oh, I'll just look it up, I guess. Damn, go up the troll. Talk to oh, it's in two. Shit, who's Jin? I don't remember anything in two. <laughs> I honestly don't remember. Uh, I don't even remember the good stuff. Like, um, who the, who the hell's the main character's name? When he was living that dream world with uh, Homura and Hikari. That was awesome. That's the best dream ever right there. He has both the waifus living together. That's like... <laughs> That's like the only thing I can remember. Aside from obviously the about the... Um, well, I don't remember the final boss either. I, I remember the storyline. The end, the, like how it relates to one, but other than that, 
Honestly, I don't remember much. I mean, I still I remember bits and pieces, but not like um the Inferno Gildo Jin. Who the hell's Jin? Is sounds familiar. Wait, is Jin that that uh that cre that uh that goofy guy with the with with the goofy blade? Or is that someone else? Jin the blade that stabs you in the beginning. Oh, guy with katana. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, okay. That guy. Okay, now I remember. Okay, it's not the goofy guy. Ugh. Well, I can say, actually, I was surprised. I thought that psycho uh, Entia hybrid guy, the crazy, you know, the guy that I said he was going to be the villain final boss slash whatever. You know, the squ uh, squinky eye guy. It's so obvious he's going to be a villain. I thought he would be the final boss, honestly. Because I thought what was going to happen is once you beat the Fog King, he comes in and he wants revenge. That's why I thought what happened. Or he takes over the Fog King's power or something. I was a little disappointed in that part, honestly. Yeah, the purple made it off. Yeah. Not to mention his eyes. Come on, man. It's very... Um... It's a it's a uh, standard trope in terms of uh, you know villains. But seriously, I thought he was gonna make a comeback because I, at first Mail was like, I'm gonna you know, I'm gonna spare you just once, and then he just goes away. You would, I, I would have thought he would have come back for like as the final boss, honestly. So, damn, it's pretty much a throwaway villain, if anything. Do you think went into universe may collide? Honestly, I don't. I don't think it will, but. Oh, actually, you're right. That could, yeah, right, right. That rifting. Yeah, that is interesting, you're right. That would be cool. That would be pretty cool to see that happen. As long as Hikari and Homer are back, that will be all good. I thought they are blades, though. Overall, I really enjoyed this. This is so good. This is Future Connected was worth playing after the meeting. I really feel Future Connected has the has a lot of personality in this one. It has a lot compared to the actual game, considering the uh, you know the it's like a chapter's worth, but so much personality. You know. And it's pretty hilarious. I know we discussed about this how uh Ricky <laughs> was mentioned so much. You learned so much about him than playing the original main game. <laughs> oh god. You learned things you would never expect it. Although it is funny to see uh Kino and Nene. Like when there were little pawns, and this lady that that's this big after one year, it's pretty interesting. That's so cool. Yeah, I loved it. I loved this. It was great. This is how this is like a perfect example of how a um, like a let's just say if it was a DLC, you know, like for uh, you know after beating game like extra DLC like you know how they have for Spider-Man like uh, the what it's called Sleeping Nights or whatever I never played the though I really do want to play because Spider-Man was awesome 
but this is like the perfect way of how you make a uh, DLC extra chapter or something. Yep, just finished, and I loved it. And you need to finish a K. It's that great. Okay, so that's the end of Xenoblade Chronicles. Next game. Next game. Last of Us 2. Which is coming out on Friday, so... That means for the rest of this week, it'll be... Overwatch, because I've, I just feel like playing it. Or Assassin's Creed Odyssey, because I feel like progressing in it. <laughs> or it might be nothing, or something random, like um, uh, Arcanite's mobile... A mobile stream or something so it's very very random up till last of us 2 which will be on friday uh yes mitz mcgee i uh yeah happy you loved it oh i loved it yeah yeah this is yeah this is definitely like like a perfect example of how it should be this if it's like this type of quality you know high quality um chapters i would definitely um buy another one if they ever like released uh like another chapter of it i would definitely buy it hands down this is this is quality stuff right here yep so that's my um so that's the plan for the rest of the week it'll be either overwatch assassin creed odyssey or a uh, mobile stream I enjoy anything with more story. Oh yeah, I agree. I'm always, I'm always, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm into like you know, unique style type games. Like, um, what was that game? What was that game? Um, shoot. Uh, it was I played it on the PS4. Or was it? Yeah, PS4. No, PS3. Oh man, no. Aura is the uh, main character, the princess girl, and this. Shoot, look at the title. But it was one of the best games ever. The storyline, the way they had the storyline with the rhyming and stuff was amazing as hell. As well. Let me see if I can find a title. On my playlist. Please. Somewhere here. There's somewhere here. Oh, damn. I have so much I have so much playlist on my YouTube it's kinda of hard to find it. Child of Light. Yeah, that was very unique and even though it's like, you know, very um very unique, but the storyline was great. I, lo I loved it. I'm always I'm I'm always up. And it, any interest in doing Persona 4 Golden? Uh, not on the PC. I actually did stream that on the Vita TV like a year or two ago. I do want to play Persona 5 Royal. I do. I really do want to play that. But there's not enough time because Last of Us coming up. But definitely Persona 5 Royal, I would definitely play because I love Persona 5. I played the Japanese version, I streamed the Japanese version, then later on I streamed the English version. Unfortunately, I was not able to get the Japanese version of Royal because I there was other games, I was playing other games at that time, and... I mean, yes, Persona 5 Royal is like, it's almost like a brand new game, but the overall basic concept is still Persona 5 so I wasn't in a rush you know when I could play when I was playing games that are completely new yeah so 
We have The Last of Us this coming Friday. And then I have till next month. And Ghost of Tsushima is hype. I think that's going to be an amazing game. I'm really, really excited for that. After that, it's going to be like a few months before Cyberpunk comes out. So that could be a good time for Persona 5 Royal and um, finish some of the other games like um, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Um, maybe Atelier Ryza. I'm not convinced about... What, 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 what are you not convinced about? I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm just curious to see you, your viewpoint. And unfortunately, Watchdog Legion and Yakuza 7 still has no release date. I played previous game they made Infamous. Yeah, they made, um... Oh, I see. Okay. I guess it's just not your type of game, I guess. I pl Um, they... I... They didn't make. Inf I think they only made one in famous. It was um, was it the second son? I know they didn't make that all in famous. They only made one of them, like an expansion or something. I think it was second son. I could be wrong. Oh no no, they made second son and a lot of those. Um, when they made second son, I think it was. I could be wrong. But whichever infamous that they worked on, a lot of it was wave review, uh, um, rave review. So, yeah, I only played an infamous uh, one, and I f didn't realize that until I think it was K that mentioned it or someone did. <laughs> they actually posted my YouTube video of it. I was like, I was like, holy crap! I did play it. Yeah, you can wait for review first. Oh, that's fair. I mean, to me. I love what I see, so I am gonna, I'm definitely gonna be playing, playing it. I love, I love the idea and style, that's enough to, you know, get me into it. It's the same thing as Vanillaware games, like Odin Spear, um, Dragon's Crown, all that. Because Vanillaware, the company, is very unique. The artistic style and everything is amazingly beautiful gameplay is very different than what most games are so i mean that's what make that company very unique and i that's why i really i love it um that's why i pretty much play as much vanilla wear games as i can and by the way 13 sentinels coming out soon too so <laughs> oh you played it you play a Japanese one? That's cool. Yeah, my friend played it. He loved it. Oh, okay. I, I can't wait for that. I, I didn't I never had a chance to import it, so I'm really excited about the um look with the uh local version. Yeah, I saw my friend Jin played it. It was I just love the artistic style, so I'm really excited to play it. Even though the gameplay is obviously, you know, different, I uh, it's not a big deal to me, you know, because I'm I'm always I'm up for different uh, style of games. I wouldn't play Tencent on Japanese unless you have a good Japanese in. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I mean, I play a lot of Japanese game. I mean, I play Sin of Kinsuke. That's one of the hardest. Um, if you don't. Yeah, that yeah, that is true. I mean, <laughs> I could say the same for Seno Kisaki. That game is like advanced Japanese right there. Considered a mass amount of text, you know, it's a Zen game, so yeah. yeah. But it's not the reason. Well, well, my reasons I didn't have the time. But yeah, I agree with the. Yeah, even I would say don't import Sen games because if you don't know how advanced the Japanese, you should never play it too. Fifty times more convoluted, <laughs> really? <laughs> That's interesting. Uh.
Uh, that should be interesting, then. Yeah, but definitely, yeah. So... I only saw a little of what I saw from Jin when he played the, uh, when the Japanese version, so I can't really say much from, aside from that. Okay. Anyway, 1 a.m., my dog, Happy, is very sleepy. She's looking at me, and she wants to sleep. So, okay, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope to, I hope to all you all enjoyed uh, Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition and Future Connected. Uh, rest of this week is very random in what, I, what will happen. But Friday would definitely be Last of Us 2. The time of streaming, I'm aiming for noon, depending on what happens at work. Thanks for watching. Uh, yeah. Uh, th um, thanks for um, watching Ogopogo and Mitz McGee. Really appreciate it. Uh, thank you very much. I re really appreciate it. And have a good night, everybody. Peace. See you all later and stay safe. Thank you for watching LL stream. If you enjoy the stream, please follow and subscribe to Happy.